Hey, what is up, YouTube? Welcome back again. It's your buddy Techno Boy, and that's a fourth channel Class D amplifier. And today I'm gonna tell you about this thing, the Class D amp kit, and how I connected them. So let's start. So this is a electrical junction box uh, made out of plastic, as I shown you in uh, other videos, making amplifier thing. A small amp making small class D amplifier and this box is like easy and very nice as you can see and um, front side a big volume and a small volume knob and that's a push type connectors and on this side nothing just a hole for ventilations and on this side the power supply 12 volt and at the back speaker connectors and RC inputs and here you can see uh, two pair of speaker connectors are there so now let's start with this circuit board as this is a CA3110 IC stereo amplifier this thing gives you like 15 plus 15 watt per channel 15 plus 15 total output 30 watt and you can give it a 12 volt 1 to 3 amp max not more than that and that's another uh, stereo kit with a PAM 8403 IC and this thing gives you 3 plus 3 watt 3 watt per channel total 6 watt so now let's start the connections as you have seen uh, this amplifier kit making in a previous video I'll give the link in the i button right here so you can go there and check them out all the connection details are there that's input that's coming to this volume control and from there it's going to the kit stereo input and this uh, green yellow green yellow these are the uh, speaker output and on this side that's the power supply and also have connected one capacitor of 35 volt and 4700 mfd to give it a support to handle the base so that's it now after that i have connected this kit and same the yellow and green these are the speaker output are going to the bottom right here left one and here the right one and then it comes to the input now that's the main input the RC socket and from there it is coming to this volume control on the left side and from there I have connected this were white blue and green to this volume control input so the input line is same it's coming from here to this volume control and also same to this volume control and from there is going this white blue and green going to that kit as the input after the volume control so now i have two volume control the big one for the big kit and the small one for the small kit right there now this kit required 5 volt but this one requires 12 volt so the main power supply right there as a 12 volt adapter connected to this thing and now the ground are the same the black wire and the yellow wire that's connected right there you can see that's a 5 volt regulator IC 7805 so I have connected this 5 volt regulator IC to the 12 volt so from 12 volt it is converting the voltage to the 5 volt and from there this yellow wire the 5 volt output is going to the kit so very simple now let me tell you this extra setting on this thing uh, how much this thing cost me so that kit is like rupees 30 from local store and that IC uh, is like uh, rupees 5 I think and that's a good uh, volume control which cost me rupees 10 so the total cost was 30 plus 10 40 and that was 5 rupees so 45 rupees and if you uh, count the wires like 10 rupees of total wires I have connected here so now converting this uh, two channel amp to a four channel amp is cost was cost me like 55 rupees only and I get clear sound from this chan 
from this kit and from that kit too. So as you know this kit is connected to this tower speakers. One is right here and another one right there. So they are having like four inch woofer and then a three inch woofer and a dome tweeter. But this kit, the small one three plus three wire, this is connected uh, to this that's the right channel with a three inch woofer and that's the left channel with a three inch woofer. These two are mounted right above the uh, main computer monitor right there and they are at the bottom the right one the left one so when I play the music and balance the sound the uh, top and bottom then it feels like the sound is coming from all this front space like you cannot understand it's coming from the bottom or the top like it's coming from this monitor screen uh, straight towards you and it sounds amazing so now let me turn this on it's on now and let's um, I'm gonna show you uh, both the sounds separately then gonna play them uh, all together so fast this big one the bottom uh, speakers are gonna work now so it's turned on and now let me use this one speakers are not working now only these two were working now let me reduce this volume and play the song and increase this volume So the sound is good right and they are pretty good speakers and clear sound crispy sound with a good amount of bass from the small speakers and from there also so now uh, let me turn both of them on and let's check the sound So that's it, that's how you can make a 4 channel class D amplifier. It's a very low profile amplifier in a small space, small components and small power supply. That's it. So that's all for today. See you in the next video. Thanks for watching. Bye bye.